when I took this job, General Odierno told me to generate requirements for the RAF. And I was able to report back to him that I did not have to do that. There are plenty of existing requirements with, with authorities and funding in place that since I had the RAF available to fill them, I was able to go and volunteer for those missions. We are getting missions from the Department of State, uh, peacekeeping and related missions or exercises that I'm using the RAF to do that come with the necessary authorities and funding. We're in South Africa for Exercise Shared Accord. What's the significance of this exercise? It's very important for both South Africa and for the United States. South Africa is very involved with peacekeeping operations throughout the continent. And this is an opportunity for them to practice their skills uh, running a, a combined uh, headquarters. They're doing that with the Brigade Talk and also the fight with as a combined uh, force at the company and battalion level, even lower at the platoon level. That's a rare, a rare task because it's difficult to get foreign partners actually trained with. It's always better to do that in South Africa or in the United States than it is to do it in a place like, uh, like uh, the Congo. So it's a good, uh, very important for the South Africans that uh, allows them to enhance their skills as peacekeepers because they're, they're active across the continent. And that valuable for us because our soldiers are getting uh, experience on different terrain. Working with the South Africans, we're learning uh, how they do peacekeeping operations. Uh, something we don't do normally, uh, so it's good to get their perspectives on how they do it and, and if we ever get the task, how we could do it better as well.